made friends with this group of uh, researchers that run a program called Core C, which is a science education outreach and research uh, program. And these guys have been amazing, not only at helping us get our bearings here and the wondrous, but uh, very unique and strange world of Thailand, but they've also helped us get our research off the ground. Uh, in particular, since we're studying reef fish foraging behavior, they helped us get out our newest fear frames. So if you're not familiar with the fear frame concept, this is a monstrosity that I built in French Polynesia to study reef fish foraging behavior. Basically, it's a jungle gym I built out of PVC, hoisted video cameras to it, and you can use those video cameras to look down on the reef and see all of the fish behavior that's happening on the reef. Um, in this system, though, I didn't want to have to go through the trouble of tracking down boatloads of PVC, so instead I actually just had gazebos shipped here, the kinds of gazebos used for tailgating. Uh, these same gazebos can be used just like the PVC jungle gym I made before. You can hoist cameras to them. The big challenge now is we've got to get cinder blocks to hold down the feet of, of these gazebos, and we've got to deploy the gazebos. <laughs> All right, so Heather and I felt like we had to update you guys and tell you this is the first time we've ridden in a car in a week and a half. Thanks to Ika here, the head honcho from Corsi here on Copenhagen. Cinder block chauffeur. That's right, he's our cinder block chauffeur, and we're super pumped because this is so much better than riding on a scooter. Yes. Why is it better than riding on a scooter, Heather? Because I feel like I'm going to die every five seconds on a scooter. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. I think also, you know, we have a windshield here, which is really amazing. You don't have sand getting blown into your face. Uh, if we did run into something, we'd be sheltered by the massive metal that this car is constructed <laughs> in. Yes. Wouldn't be your body smacking against said object. We're in a protected box. We're in a protected box. So, Aika, the man, he's as... in a Faraday's cage, by the way, if we get hit by lightning, it's much safer being in a car. There we go. Another plus. <laughs> so, Aika, as, as lovable as he is tall, thank you for the chauffeuring. And we got our cinder blocks. So... With the help of our new friends, Cinderblocks check, and fortunately for us, these guys were willing to help us actually deploy the fear frames. Yes, 